Hello guys, my name is Evelyn Simpson. Welcome to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So today we're continuing my zodiac sign series where we create Sims inspired by zodiac signs. So the last time we created Aries and that means that this time we're creating Taurus because that's kind of the next one. <laughs> so I've also decided by the way to keep doing these on Fridays or keep making these Sims on Fridays because um, a fair amount of you keep asking when your sign is coming up and I figured it would just be better and easier for you guys to kind of know when it's coming up exactly. So we're continuing this on Fridays but anyways let's talk a little bit about the Taurus. Their symbol is the bull, their element is earth, their ruling planet is Venus, and spirit color is pink. Their flowers are rose, poppy, and foxglove. I didn't say that for the other ones, but I thought it was quite cute that it was rose and poppy. <laughs> um, and their strengths are reliable, patient, practical, devoted, responsible, and stable, while their weaknesses are stubborn, possessive, uncompromising. They like gardening, cooking, music, romance, high quality clothes, and working with hands, and they dislike sudden changes, complications, insecurity of any kind, and synthetic fabrics. So in my family, we got two Tauruses as far as I remember. Um, my brother-in-law is a Taurus, but I don't know him well enough to say if all the traits fit him. I can definitely say though that he is responsible and stable and he's very patient. That I know, but he also kind of likes cooking. I mean, he, at least Christmas food. <laughs> and as for the high quality clothes, he doesn't care about that kind of stuff, so I don't yeah, I don't know about that one. I don't know about stubborn, persistent, uncompromising either. Uh, but yeah, the practical, patient, responsible and stable, definitely, and reliable. He's a very reliable person. So other than that, there is my nephew, but he's almost two, so I don't really know. <laughs> he doesn't really have, I don't, I can't tell his personality yet. <laughs> you know what I mean? So other than that, my, one of my best friends in Denmark is actually a Taurus. Her birthday's on the 22nd, so, um, and she is very stubborn. <laughs> She's, she's a very stubborn person, but she's also very devoted. Uh, obviously, I live in Scotland, she lives in Denmark, and she's very devoted to her friendship despite the long distance, and she's very reliable. She's not very patient, <laughs> but um, she also, cooking, I mean, she does care about food, she does care about music a lot. Is she romantic? Yes, she's definitely romantic. Uh, gardening? I mean, no, not really. She lives in a in an apartment, but she does like plants a lot. <laughs> so there is that. Does that count? I don't know. <laughs> Other than that, high quality clothes. She definitely loves high quality clothes. Let me tell you, she loves high quality clo clothes. Um, synthetic fabrics. No, she doesn't like that. <laughs> she cares about materials as well. So I think that kind of fits her a little bit, to be honest. But anyways, let me know if any of these traits fit you guys. If you are a Taurus, you can leave a comment in the comment section if you want to. I'm very curious. I think these um, I think these horoscopes are kind of funny to read out loud. I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, we're making Adele Ashcraft. She is named after Adele, who's one of my favorite singers, who also happens to be a Taurus. So of course, she had to have her name. Ashcraft is just because it started with an A. <laughs> so I also feel like it's kind of a strong name. I don't know. Maybe it's the craft in it. I don't, I don't fully know. Anyways, for her clothing I was trying to um, kind of go for a more of a styled kind of look does that make any sense uh, with with the Pisces sim that I made a couple weeks ago her her outfits were more like boho inspired and with Aries that I made two weeks ago her style was more like punkish because she had to be fierce and everything with this one I was trying to go for that that like styled high quality kind of vibe so we can pretend like the knit dr knitted dress that she was wearing in the first outfit is some sort of expensive knit or something she was wearing high thigh leather boots as well so there's high quality clothes at least not synthetic fabrics <laughs> uh, we can pretend like the knit is made of mohair or something maybe wool probably wool over mohair i don't like how they treat the, the rabbits okay anyways <laughs> let's not get into that for this outfit as well with the shirt um it looks like a silk shirt i really like it has this luxurious vibe to it it feel it looks expensive you know what i mean so also her hair is pink and we're because uh, what was it? the colors are green and pink so I made her hair pink and her clothing more green and then with the makeup I was trying to like make it look good with the pink because you know pink and green don't necessarily go together very well <laughs> but I was doing my best 
As for her traits, I made her romantic music lover and foodie because uh, romantic is because they like romance and music lovers because they like music and foodies because they like cooking. <laughs> so I thought those fit. Also because the other ones are kind of kind of difficult to fit into Sims traits. So I figured figured those three would actually fit her a little bit. I made her aspiration find soulmate because she likes romance as well, and also because I'm pretty sure I bet somewhere that. Uh, once they find someone, they're really devoted to them, so I figured that Soulmate would kind of fit her as well. But anyways, I hope you like Adele here. You can download her off the gallery. My ID is the same as my YouTube name, so Evelyn Sims. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to like, subscribe, and all that good stuff if you did, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye! When you are with me Sometimes I forget to breathe See